Wireless charging is very convenient and very easy, and something that I really miss when a device doesn't include it. I'm Joe Levi with Pocket Now, and here's how you can retrofit your smartphone or tablet with Qi wireless charging support. So let's take a look. This is a uh, Samsung made Galaxy Nexus, and you can see here I've got a case on it. This obviously does not have Qi wireless charging built in, but you can see right there, it does have Qi wireless charging available to it. So let's go ahead and take all the parts apart here. This is the device. Now, luckily this does have a removable back and a removable battery, but your device doesn't have to, okay? I'm gonna show you two different methods of mounting on this, pros and cons of each really fast. This guy, it's gonna run you anywhere between five and maybe $25 uh, through Amazon, including shipping, depending on where you are in the world. This one was $9 delivered through Amazon Prime, so very nice. What you'll notice here is this is the charging coil. It is relatively flexible. It's got this nice little adhesive strip that I haven't taken off yet because I wanted to show you guys first. And then a ribbon cable and a micro USB connector. Down at the bottom of the device, you've got a micro USB connector. And there's an orientation to this. You'll notice that the narrow part is on the top, the wide part is on the bottom. So on this charger, you put in the narrow part on the top and the wide part on the bottom. If your device is oriented differently, they do have different skews. So you can get this that has that upside down and make it a little bit easier and nicer for you. Keep that in mind when ordering yours. But all you have to do, plug in, route that cable. Now I'm blocking my speaker here a little bit, which I haven't noticed any problem in practice. But if you want, there are versions of this device that you basically shift this connector down to the left or to the right so that if you've got a, a port over here on the side or whatnot, you don't have to run it diagonally across your phone. You can, it's not a problem. It won't hurt anything, but uh, bear in mind that they do have those that have the, uh, you know, this ribbon cable on either side. So. From there, I can simply snap the back cover on, just like that, make sure everything's nice and tight, snap it on, and I'm good to go. If your device doesn't have a removable back cover, that's okay. All you gotta do is snap that back on for you. We're gonna pretend now that this is a non-removable back cover. I just lay that in place, I get my case, start at the bottom in this case and just wrap it around and now i'm retrofit i can take this charger or any other chi compatible charger lay my device on top and within seconds we're charging it's just that simple and this is one of the best retrofits that you can do to your smartphone or tablet so to recap, the only two devices that you need to enable Qi charging on your smartphone or tablet is a charging pad, which should work with any Qi compatible device, and this little Qi coil that we showed you plugged in right into the bottom. Once you've got those two married up together, you're charging wirelessly. If you liked what you saw here, make sure you give the video a thumbs up. Of course, subscribe to the video channel if you haven't done so already. You can follow us on all of your favorite social media sites. We are Pocket Now on all of them and i'm at joe levi over on twitter which is the best place where you can find me thank you very much for watching and make sure you stay tuned for more informative videos just like this one in the coming days